Tonight, neighbors are on edge after a package bomb exploded outside a church in Beaumont. Now, this bomb is the second one found in that area in just two weeks. Our Jonathan Martinez is in Beaumont with witnesses hoping that these are isolated incidents and not part of a dangerous trend like the one we saw just a couple of months ago in Austin. Guys, we can tell you there are a lot of people on edge out here tonight after a second explosive device is found in just as many weeks. And while police aren't saying if the two are connected, it is still certainly enough to have plenty of people out here pretty worried. It really is scary. I mean, who's to say that they don't come back? With crime scene tapes still up surrounding St. Stephen's Episcopal Church, many residents left shaken at news of a package bomb being detonated near the doorsteps. That includes Amanda Pena, who lives directly across the street and was up early to bottle feed her newborn, who says she heard it go off. To see this happen right here and then to be staying here, it just terrifies me. Church leaders say sometime between Wednesday night and Thursday morning services, the device exploded just outside the building, shattering windows and leaving holes in the wall. While no one was injured, the church, which also serves as a school, was evacuated and remains closed until further notice. It makes you wonder, is there more? Uh, are you checking the rest of the school? Are you checking the playgrounds? Where are my children? That sort of thing. Investigators say it was only two weeks ago at this Starbucks not far from the church that another explosive device with a note attached was found by an employee. Authorities wouldn't comment if the two cases are connected, but are assuring the public they have all available resources investigating, including members from the FBI, the ATF, and local police. We want the citizens to know that we're doing everything possible to make sure that, uh, that this suspect or suspects are, are captured as soon as possible. For residents with uneasy nerves, they say the sooner the better. I'm certain that our law enforcement agencies will find whoever did this and stop them. Investigators do tell us they plan to be out here for several more hours. Meantime, parents tell us the school will likely be closed through the weekend. Reporting from Beaumont, I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC Channel 2 News.